Okay naman. Okay naman. By God's Masayang grace. Masaya. So, masaya kami kasi we were able to survive. Yep. COVID-19 all by God's grace and Praise of course Lord. nag-work ang Lord through people like, like you Lala na you, you were there encouraging us praying mm-hmm. for us uh, salamat salamat sa inyo lahat and of course salamat sa Lord na napaka gracious at napaka buti ng ating Panginoon yes tuwing umaga yan si Lala sila Arnie no nagtatext yan sa akin dala siya na umaga bro magsuob ka na o oh, ako rin <laughs> magsuob na kayo bro araw araw yun <laughs> magsuob na kayo para gumaling na kayo <laughs> More than two More weeks. than two weeks. So, Almost three weeks then. Almost three weeks. So, yeah. mm-hmm. So, at least, okay na kayo ngayon. Oh. Ang, ang pula-pula ng mga face nyo. Rosy cheeks ba? Okay. Uh, sinampal kasi. Oo. Diba? Instant blush. Oh, at least, okay kayo ngayon. So, ano pinagkakabalahan mo ngayon, Johan? Back to work. Oo, oh, back to work na kami. Ito, since last week. So, unti-unti, na uh, binabalik na ulit yung dating routines. Mm. Ayan. Oh. nag exercise na ulit, nagpa-boxing na ulit. Oh. Push up, push up. Susuntuhan na ulit. Nalala ko nun, nung pandemic, yes, last year, mayroon, 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 magkakaroon ko ng studio ko si Iyohan. Oo, oh, oh, yun pala. Oh. Welcome, so, this is studio. The Upper yeah. Deck, home studio. Home studio. Kung magkakaroon ko magpano dyan, ha? And uh, ikaw naman, Jacob, how are you? Okay naman. Ito, parehas kami ni Utol, back to work na rin. Uh, nakakamiss din kasi parang almost three weeks din kami naka-off sa trabaho. Siyempre, habang nagpapagaling sa COVID, more time to pray, to reflect. Oo, ganun. Tsaka mas uh, nakakachat ka namin kasi nga tuwing umaga nagpapaalala ka na magsuob na kami. Ayun. Ang sakit, sakit sa ilong. Ang sakit sa ilong yung suyo. Oh, oh, siyempre. Oh, yeah. oh. Natanggal yung bara sa ilong ko eh. Defective eh, defective. Effective talaga. Effective. Ano naman? Ang dyan. Nung isang araw, meron kaming nakita isang dinosaur. <laughs> Magkwento ka mo. Oh. Oh, man, Tita, baka may kwento. Ano, Natalie? Ano daw? Magaling daw, magaling. Ma- o ano-ano, oh. ano, kwento nyo, ano, pagong sa pagong. Kwento kami. Kwento, kwento namin sa pagong. <laughs> kwento natin sa pagong. <laughs> uh, seriously, diba, sabi nyo nga na it's, it's a, it was a roller coaster. Diba? Yeah. So, imagine, hindi lang kasi isa eh. Lahat kayo talagang. Oh, yes. Yes. Parang tinest talaga kayo guys, no? Yeah. Talaga kayo ni Lord. Alam mo yung isang nangyari sa inyo, naalala ko yung story ni Job. Diba? Yeah. Favorite, favorite story ko yun, ito ba ito? Lahat talaga, na no, no, lagi. Pero siguro ganun nga talaga. Yeah. And um, kwento, ka, kwento naman kayo, how, uh, paano nyo nag-beat yung, yung uh, COVID na yan, Mr. COVID na yan? Paano nyo lang kami? Alam ko, nahihirapan uh, kayo, diba? Anong feeling nung hindi kayo makahinga, nung-ubo, anong pakiramdam, anong nasa isip nyo, diba? Mentally, emotionally, spiritually, diba? May na-question ba si God? Diba ba kayo yung pinangyari? Ikaw muna bro. Ako? Sino? Sino ba? <laughs> Ikaw muna ako ito, Iwan. Ano yung mga na-realize mo? Or nang pumahit ka ba? Lalo? Hindi, <laughs> nangyari kasi sa amin, uh, to everybody who's watching, you know, uh, mag-ingat po tayo kasi ang yep. COVID po talaga ay hindi It's real. real. It's real. Uh, sa mga hindi po naniniwala na sa pagsusuot ng mask at facial, eh, makaprotektahan po kayo, magsuot na po kayo. At sa mga hindi pa po nagpapavaccinate, uh, by all means po, uh, have yourself vaccinated kasi po totoo po ang COVID-19 and can, it, it can cost you your life. Mm. Ayan. So sa amin po kasi yung nangyari, ang una naging ng symptomatic, yung una pong nagkaroon ng symptoms sa family namin was my dad. So, weekend po yun. I think it was a Saturday na nilagnat po si dad. Meron din siyang ubot si Paul. May, May 1. May 1 yan. May 1 yun. Yeah. Oh, May 1 Labor Day, no? 
Tapos the following day, Sunday, May 2, ako naman po yung nakaramdam ng symptoms sa parang sinisipon ako tapos medyo inuubo na rin. Parang mabigat na yung pakiramdam ko. I was actually guesting for Aaliwin Kita. Yung uh, show online show po ng Aliw Award. So habang kumakanta ako doon, ramdam ko na kasi habang kumakanta ako, sipon ko tumutulo. Singot ako na singot, gano'n, gano'n. Tapos yun po, after nung show, nung gabi, yung mabigat na. Tapos the following day, ramdam ko pa siya para talaga akong... Yung feeling po ng may trangkaso. Flu-like symptoms like uh, fever, headache, uh, muscle pain. Yan po yung aking mga naranasan. And then two days later, mga Wednesday yun. Hindi, may, may four ako naman yung nagkaroon ng symptoms. Ayun, no. Yeah. Uh, Tapos yun po. Uh, may six, nagpa-swab uh, test ako. Ayun, nagpa-swab yeah. test siya. Sa kasi dad, daddy po namin. Uh, they both tested positive. So yeah. sabi ko, kami siyempre automatic ni mommy. Positive na kami because we we live uh, in one house. So yung nga po, sure enough, when we had our swab test also, we we tested positive. So yung po, uh, nakamonitor po kami nung aming oxygen level. Meron kaming uh, pulse oximeter. Tapos uh, dumating po sa time na si dad, yung daddy namin, kasi yung daddy po namin is a, uh, has a comorbidity. He underwent... Uh, Quintuple bypass. So, inoperahan na po siya sa heart in, back in 2016. So, kaya medyo high risk talaga siya for COVID. And yung nga po, nung nagka-COVID siya, talaga binabantay namin yung oxygen level niya. Pero yung nga po, as we were monitoring our oxygen levels, yung kay dad, nagda-drop na siya sa 88. Yung sabi ng mga doctors, kapag uh, ang oxygen level mo would drop, would be lower than 94. Kailangan ma-ER na. Kailangan ka na magpunta ng hospital kasi you would be at high risk for... Uh, for hypoxia, hypoxia, yeah. or or, kaya, or or that would reveal that you are you are having pneumonia already. Ayan, kasi may may problem na sa pagkakaroon ng oxygen sa dugo mo eh because of your lungs. Yeah, oo, bumaba, nag-88 na. Pero hindi pa naman umabot sa point na nahihirapan ng huminga si dad. So bago pa dumating yun, uh, by God's uh, sovereign providence, uh, we were able to bring dad sa, sa hospital And yun nga, ang grasya pa ng Panginoon doon kasi uh, puno, puno po lahat ng hospitals dahil nga sa COVID. Wala full capacity talaga. lahat. Full capacity. Yeah. Bilang two cups, full talaga. Full yeah. capacity talaga. Tapos, ang blessing po doon kasi si dad, overnight lang siya nagstay sa ER the following day. May room na ka. Okay. May room na nag-open. So, yeah. na-amaze na kami. Good. We, we, the God is good. We were praying na, kasi syempre, iba ang manage, mas maganda ang management sa pasyente kapag na, na-admit na siya sa room eh. So, yun. Uh, na-admit si dad. Uh, he was managed there very well. Nabigyan siya ng mga gamot na kailangan niya. Kami naman po sa bahay, ang iniinom namin was, syempre, ang virus kasi, wala naman talagang anti, hindi mo siya talaga pwedeng mawala. It's self-limiting. Kailangan mo lang i-manage yung mga symptoms ng virus. So, we were taking our multivitamins. Nag-take din kami ng ivermectin for five days. Tapos, uh, nag-prophylactic uh, antibiotic na rin kami. Kasi kung sakali mang mag-progress yung COVID. Into pneumonia. At least may pang-contra na. Oo, oh, may contra, yeah. pang-contra sa secondary infection. And yun po, sabi ni Lala, lagi niya kaming tinitext na magsuob. So, nagsuob po kami na nagsuob. Tuwing alas 7 ng umaga, bro, magsuob ka na, bro. Ayan, o. Oh. Ano? Sabi ni Lala, magsuob. Nag-alab kami niya ni Lala. <laughs> Tinagpa <laughs> ako, eh. <laughs> Ayan. So, yun. Grabe yung inexperience namin. So, kami na nag-leave na ako sa work. Pati yung brother ko. Pero ang... Ang ko pa sa hospital. Oo, ayun, oo. Ano sabi mo la? Sorry. <laughs> hindi ko na hindi ko narinig. Ano 'yun? Ay, oo, oh, yung sa akin din. Oh, there was Yeah, oh, there was one night kasi na nagmo-monitor ako ng oxygen level. Tapos parang bumibigat lalo yung pakiramdam ko. So nakita ko nagda-drop na rin ako, nag-88, 89 na yung aking oxygen level. So Punta kami ng hospital. Pagdating sa ER, ang taas-taas ng oxygen na rin yung saturation. Pag measure yeah. ulit ng O2 level ko, aba, nag-98. Yung pala so, medyo, may, medyo may tama yung, ano, yung oximeter na binili namin. Yung, Parang 150 lang yata yun. Eh. Oo. Oh, so yun, nung, buti naman yung in-advise ako ng doctor to, to go home then the same night. Pero yun, sobrang bigat talaga sa pakiramdam. And syempre, yung nga, katulad ng sinabi ng brother ko kanina, yung mga times na dinadanas namin yung COVID, ginamit din yun ng Lord para kami ay mas mapalapit sa kanya. We, we, we have, we were able, He was able to, to, to draw us closer to Him. 
Uh, we had the uh, time of uh, prayer, yung individual prayers namin. So ako nga, sabi ko nga sa Lord, uh, kasi nga, COVID, daming namamatay. Sabi ko, Lord, ako, ready naman ako. Uh, kahit kunin mo na ako, Lord, uh, basta spare mo lang yung family. My, my brother, my parents, ako, Lord, I'm ready. I'm ready to to see you face to face. Actually, mas maganda pa ngayon eh. So, if you are in Christ, yes. uh, you you can be very confident that uh, if That's your right. life here on earth would end, you would be in the presence of God because the Bible tells us that when a person dies, there are only, there are only two possible places where a person would go, where the spirit of the person would go because the physical body stays here, right? Uh, it's being buried bubulok yung katawan ng tao mm. pero the soul and the spirit of the person lives on tuloy, so tuloy. either the soul or the spirit would go in the presence of God in heaven or heaven. sa kabila okay so eternal damnation eternal damnation so if That's you are right. in Christ okay the Bible tells us clearly that salvation is only uh, is only possible by faith Okay, by, by grace, grace alone, through faith. through faith alone, in Christ alone. In Christ alone. So if we are in Christ, we can be confident, as the Bible says, that uh, we can have eternal life, that we can be spending the rest of eternity with God in heaven, should our lives here on earth would end. So yun, yun yung pinangahawakan ko. So sabi ko, Lord, I'm ready to, to meet you. I'm ready to see you face to face. Siguro spare mo muna yung parents ko, pati yung brother ko, pero ako ready na ako, Lord. So yun yung mga times na... And at the same time, uh, uh, I was also meditating on uh, James chapter 1, verse 2, wherein it says, uh, Consider it all joy when you face trials of various kinds, knowing that these uh, testing of your faith produces endurance. Yes. So, sabi ko, uh, ito dapat yung perspective ng isang Christiano, ng isang believer in Christ. Whatever you will go through in this life, in this earth, you should consider it joy, whether it's a trial temptation, struggle, difficulties, what have you, you consider it joy because you know that your faith is being tested and the Lord is molding your character into Christ-likeness. You're being sanctified by the Lord. In other words, uh, God is molding you into the person that He wants you to be. And what is that person? A person that is like Christ. Yeah, kung titignan talaga natin, kung baga kahit anong pag-iingat ang gawin natin, uh, ang Lord talaga ay kumikilos, no? He is um, sovereign over all. Na tipong mag-ingat ka lagi, mag-facial ka, mag-face mask ka, di ba? Kumbaga, these things would really help us, di ba? It's gonna protect us to a certain extent. But again, uh, there would be times that when the Lord um, allows uh, people to be infected with COVID like us, di ba? Kahit anong pag-iingat, pag-alcohol. And I think that reminds all of us of that perspective that we all should have na at the end of the day si Lord pa rin talaga ang security natin uh, siya yung may uh, may control ng lahat ng bagay and regardless of what you and I may be going through the best response that all of us can have is to turn to our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ and tulad ng sinabi niya diba, he was ready to go and uh, ito yung dapat na maging sigurado tayo diba? kasi dito sa mundo diba, ang daming mga bagay and talagang hindi natin control most of, most of the things that we go through but we should be resting in the fact that the Lord is in absolute control of everything and we being the people the human race which He created diba? we are uh, we are accountable to the God who created us and that is why it is just but fitting that when the Lord makes us realize na mag um, na nagkasala tayo, di ba? Walang taong perfect. We have broken the law of God. We have offended the holiness of God. And that demands justice, eternal separation from God in a place called hell. But again, the Lord is so gracious, di ba? He sent His one and only Son, si Jesus Christ, who lived a perfect life that you and I could never live. He died on that cruel cross to pay for the penalty for the past, present, and future sins of those who would repent and believe in the Lord Jesus Christ. And hindi natapos ang story doon because after three days, Jesus Christ rose again from the dead. And the Bible tells us when we repent and believe in Jesus, we will be saved. And only then we can have that 
confidence that when we die, we are going to heaven, we would have eternal life, the Holy Spirit would indwell in us and turn us into the kind of person He wants us to be, and that is to be like Christ. And again, we would have that eternal perspective na alam natin na ang buhay natin dito sa mundo, it is just but temporary. It's gonna end, what is 77 years, di ba? Yun yung uh, common na life expectancy ng tao compared to what's gonna be Afterwards, gaano ba kahaba ang eternity? It's not just for a hundred, five hundred, or a thousand, or a million years. It's gonna be infinite. And you, co- you compare that to that 77 years. Suppose you live 77 years in this world, di ba? And I believe, di ba, we should be focusing more on the things that have eternal bearing as compared to the things that don't. A temporary lang. So we need to have that perspective. And COVID, the reality of COVID reminds all of us that our life is so fragile. Now in a snap, you can lose your life. In a snap, in a twinkling of an eye, you can lose everything. But once you are in Christ, you are eternally secured. He's going to be um, he's gonna be making sure that sa lahat ng bagay na ginagawa mo, you are aligned to His will, to His word. Diba? Yeah, so yung sinabanggit niya nga, we, we repent and believe in Jesus so we can be saved. That may not save us from COVID because you know, the Lord might allow you to get COVID like us. Kami, nagka-COVID kami. Kala namin, mamatay na rin Dami kami. Dami na nga namin alcohol, uh, nagka-COVID na kami. Alcohol dito. And it, uh, trusting in Jesus may not save you from COVID, but yeah. it definitely would save you from eternal damnation in hell. And that is the worst problem that every human yes. being faces. The problem faces. of the world is not COVID. The yeah. real problem of the world is sin. Kasi lahat po tayo ay mga makasalanan. Sa Tagalog, kasalanan. Sin, yeah. kasalanan. We all have offended God and we all need Christ. Kasi hindi, hindi po natin uh, maa-attain yung perfection. Eh. Lahat right. po tayo makasalanan. Pero si Jesus Christ po, siya yung perfect. Okay, when He came down here on earth, He lived that perfect and righteous life. And doon namatay siya sa cross, pinagbayaran niya yung kasalanan ng lahat ng mga taong magre-repent at maniniwala sa kanya. That's right. Yeah. So, we all need Christ. We may need the vaccine, but the vaccine will not, you know, uh, save us from hell. It will save us from COVID, but not from hell. Jesus Christ will save us from eternal damnation. And That's right. He can make us right with God. Ayan. So, si Jesus Christ po ang gusto namin talagang i-point out dito more than the vaccine, more than the face shields and the face mask and the social distancing. It's Jesus Christ. It's the Lord Jesus. Yeah. Yeah. Alam mo, may side comment na naman si Mama. Sabi ni Mama, Ah, yung paninangyari sa kanila, no? Ang kukapo, no? Sabi mo, pastor ba yan? Ito nga mo siya makakatawa. Ah, okay. But seriously, ang maganda lang dito sa nangyari kasi sa Indigas family, they have wisdom. They have wisdom to, uh, to beat COVID, for example, ah, uh, yun lang yung sinasabi ng med, ah, uh, medica, yeah. diba? may, may, may alam sila, ano, uh, paano, na, 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 pa, ano, gawin sila sa mga medical experts, yung, yung mga symptoms, yung mga, mga, mga gamot na tinake sila, guys, by the government, na kung ano-ano pa, and then, ah, uh, financially, diba, alam natin yan, mm-hmm. na secure nyo lang, insurance, is very important, diba, guys, yes. kung gusto nyo i-share, yung mga tao din na nakikinig, yeah. And then, uh, yun nga, yung, yung sinasabi nila, spiritually, yung emotionally, supported sila ng mga friends. Supported and kami ni Lala. Supported yes. kami ni Lala. Uh, friends and family. Mm-hmm. Nakikita ko, dami nang mamahal sa Enriquez Brothers. Uh, Mas marami yung nagmamahal kay Laardi Lozada. Oo. Oh. Oh. <laughs> kami, nagmamahal kami <laughs> sa'yo. <laughs> Oo, oh, diba? Idol ka na. Wala, may nagmamahal. <laughs> Anyway, uh, yun nga, tapos, uh, yun, family talaga. Kayo, kayo nagtulungan dyan. Wala na, wala na, wala na, wala na, wala na, wala kami lang, kami apat na. Just to join, yun nga, talagang, take the drink, nag-repent sila, diba? <laughs> Repent, and pray, yeah. diba? They, uh, nag-meditate. Yep. And then, ano ko ba yung ginawa nyo? They, 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 Netflix. Uh, like Netflix, like please. Kahit kami COVID, kahit kami COVID, nag-search pa yung mga yan. So, yun talaga important. So, yeah. kailangan nila to secure your uh, spiritual. Yep, that's uh, right. Sige, 
Yes, subscribe Ano ba 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 Dami, hindi ko na maalala. Mga bawal, mga bawal na gamot. <laughs> mga bawal na gamot. Pero ang pinigoy yun na yung nakapagpagaling sa Nagpagaling sa amin yung pagsusuob. Yun, yung pagsusuob. Yeah. Importante po yun. Yung kapag kayo ay tinatrangkaso. Oh, yung turo sa amin nila Arnie yan, magsuob. Pamana nila Arnie. Anong nagsusuob ka? Anong na-realize mo? Mainit, diba? Mainit, saka ano, sakit sa ilong. <laughs> saka maalat sa ilong. Maalat. At saka bro, ang, ang, ano ko rin, ang isang pag-concern dito si Johan, kasi may, ano eh, hmm. yung sinusalitis, diba? Oo. Oh, uh, ayaw nga mag-soob dyan na, eh. Pinipilit ko nga mag-soob dyan. Ayaw eh. Sabi niya, mag-soob ka na bro. Ayaw. 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 Oh, si Jacob, sabi ko. Ay, nag-sobe, nakikita ko eh. Kitang ikaw, Jesus. Pwede ko mabal, sabi ba niyan, sa kapatid mo sila, nag yung mga problem internal. So, hindi na si Johan, my girl. Oo nga. So, mahirap yun. Imagine that, kung may ganun kong sakit, pwede kumain ng mga fruits. Tama, tama. Like, alam mo, sige, important. Oo, daming bawal. Bawal ng, ano, kape. Bawang kape. Oh, yung mga ka ng, ano natin, ay, mag-i-mag po, meron tayong mga stones. Oh. So, nga na talaga yung health. So, mabuti naman na ka-survive sila. Lord! Yes, Lord. Yes, hindi ka ba naman ng, ano, applause. Lagyan natin ang applause. Ay, Lord. Yes. Lagyan natin ang applause. Ano? Ano sabi ni Lala? Kamanta kami? Sabi nila, world class performance daw in Jesus Brothers. Thanks, God. Yeah. Thank you so much, guys, for your talent. Sobrang ang dami na blessed. Maraming salamat sa uh, sharing nyo tonight. Yep. And uh, sana maraming pa tayong uh, mga projects, mga shows, and yes. that thing. And uh, yun, keep on sharing your talent. Keep on singing. Diba? Dahil yun yung sabi ko sa inyo before, hindi pa kayo pwedeng mawala. <laughs> mm-hmm. hindi, hindi, pwede, hindi kayo kukunin talaga ni Lord kasi marami pa kayong mission dito sa mundo. And that's it, diba? Nakikita niyo naman, diba? Yung talent niyo, rare, diba? So, kayo nang may ganyan, uh, mapamusic man, o kung saan mo kayo ilagay, diba? Tatalino, lahat na. <laughs> so, marami pang mga bagay na malawak pa yung ma maaabot ay I mean, malawak pa yung hanggang iba, buong mundo <laughs> yung mga taong kailangan yung abutin so yeah. we need people like you <laughs> so thank you and also I'll take this opportunity na rin no, na pagkaramatan kayo siyempre di ba because of you I'm so honored kaya rin karoon ng mga friends na rin yan lalo na kami lalo na kami we're so honored to have La Arnie Lozada yes So our friend. Tama ba yun, bro? Tama yun. Kung diba? naman yun, no? So, magkabaro 